the Detroit neighborhood that's been the target of arsons demanding the city come and demolish the burned out homes that are left behind. Yes, indeed. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shakehead is live on the city's southwest side right now with much more on this. Hi there, Simon. Hey there, guys. You know what? I'm not happy about this. I was here six weeks ago and I was looking at this, and here we are again. I'm still looking at it, and so are the people who live here. Now, the mayor's office has said they are making progress. Some work has, be, has been done, but clearly not enough. This cell phone video captures flames ripping through homes on the 5200 block of Proctor in southwest Detroit. The arson fires taking out three different homes, endangering the lives of many, including small children living nearby. It's been hell. Because nothing's been done. We've, we haven't seen no city coming out to comply. Lisa Gonzalez is fuming mad and with good reason. She talked to Action News exactly six weeks ago when the city promised to prioritize tearing down these dangerous properties. But they're still here. If you could speak directly to the mayor, what would you say to him? Don't forget about 48210. We need help over here. We we're all we, all of us neighbors have been trying to keep it together. It's not just the homes. When it rains, it pours. Lisa's truck has been broken into and her kids still can't play outside. She hopes the city will make good on their promise soon. A lot more arsons and a lot more stuff could happen. We've already had breaking ins into the houses, breaking into our vehicles. We have to stay up 24 hours almost every night. Now, a spokesman for the mayor says the debris seen out here will also be cleaned up and a remaining house torn down by month's end. Behind the scenes, we know they've been working to address environmental concerns. Also, any contractors will be held accountable if they left anything out here that they should not have. We will be out here in a couple weeks to make sure that they keep their word on all of this and get it all cleaned up once and for all. We'll send it back to you. All right, Simon, thank you for that. We know you'll keep your eye on it and hope that thing comes down sooner than later. Well, the program that is helping.